Hey folks, welcome back to DCS. Lately I've been flying the A10A on Enigma server a little bit to try and counter the Frogfoot, so I've flown the Frogfoot excessively over the last few weeks, and generally when I find myself on Enigmas now, the Frogfoot's all I really want to fly, because if you ditch everything it's actually a pretty, pretty damn potent fighter. But it's also obviously good for getting you uh, spawn points towards getting the MiG-29, which is my other favourite thing to fly right now. So I thought I'd give the A-10 a, a try because I feel like I've neglected uh, blue team's uh, to ground options having not really touched anything apart from the Skyhawk in the last like two months. So today we're going to be taking out the A-10. Currently we are up at Gele, so let's uh, set the map. Um, here we are in the centre. We're going to head southeast towards two apps and hit the units in this sector, sector 3-5. But if we don't find anything there, we'll just keep moving east until we do. At the moment, the enemy are obviously spawning at Sochi because it's not a frontline base, so all of their fires will be coming from there. Given that I am further back from my cop, and currently the closest hostile continent is 60 miles away, I would imagine that anything spawning from my cop will ping on his EWR reports before I do, especially given that I'm going to be quite low, below the mountain peaks that are in this kind of area uh, north of Sochi. So, fingers crossed, we should be able to go by relatively uninterrupted. Alright. Fish bed within 30 miles is a little bit disconcerting. But if he's more than 10 away, then EWR has line of sight restrictions. So if I head kind of a bit more east direct and get behind the mountains and sort of make a, a sort of lower egress, or ingress rather. Then hopefully he'll not see me and leave me alone. Touch wood. Oh, he's getting closer and he's very high up as well. Um, friendly picture puts one friendly vaguely in that direction and it's another right turn. But I can't see any um, hostile EWRs on RWR, so as far as I'm concerned, I shouldn't be appearing on the reports for him. So if he goes within 10, I'll appear on his reports, even if there is a line of sight block. Just looking for that A-10 being killed. Alright, how far out is that high? In the reports, because if he dies, I know that the MiG's on a All right. warpath for me. He's cold now, that's good. Mirage is hot, but he's 40 miles away. Well, I do see him on radar, or RWR, even. This might end in a horrible, sticky way. MiG-21 is hot again. Um, Angel's 4. So our altitude currently is... Um, but Angel's 1, essentially, so he's higher than us. And he's in this kind of direction. I feel like he's close enough that I should be able to see him, but he might be below the ridges. And I will now be appearing on his RWR report. He's in that direction now. Flanking right. Oh, I see him actually. Something's smoking over there. That's the A-10. Looks like the A-10 took some hits. 173. For 6. Oh, there he is. He's going for the A-10. Oh, that's not good. Not sure if he's seen me yet. I'm gonna like my turn and try and get a tail aspect shot. Sure. Splash on. Fox two. Oh, get him! Yes. I don't really want to climb because it's going to put me in line of sight of stuff and then I'll be easy to find. But if I don't climb then it'll be very difficult to engage anything on the ground. Some recon would be really great right now. Right, so there's unlikely to be any units in the forest. But I imagine we're now on the edge of the sector so any clearings will likely have and, uh, targets you in know them. how hard it is to fly this stupid thing? 
Are they alive or dead? Uh, that's the question. They all look dead, maybe, except for that thing. Not sure. Oh, yeah, that thing is shooting at me. Look like a tank. So it's the leftmost thing at that base. Rifle. Should deal with him. That was a PC 76. Come down. 145. For nine, he's heading cold. That's fine, I can live with that. Oh god, two five five. Where is that? Yeah, he's in front of me. Oh, I see the I'm seeing this. I shot at him. I thought he has like the J11 skin, so I thought it was the fucking. Ah, yeah, you know, the A4 one. Nah, I need to get that. Yeah, so it's a big old fucking yeah, SG-27. 2 2 4 for 3. Yeah, I remember my friend was saying, oh, there's an SG-27 tagging on the runway. Oh, there he is. Look at me talking about it. I don't see any SG-27. He's talking about me. He's talking about me. see a bunch of factory buildings over there but I need to wipe out the sands first. This might become a one-way trip again. I'm, I'm pretty fucking terrible at surviving shit like this. I think I can see where they're situated actually. Uh, Breaker, you got a MiG-21 at 2225. Could you please oh, allow me to...
Hey, uh, A4, the Sun Skylands runway, you can take off, I'll just stand. What the fuck is going on? Um, I could really use some help at two apps if anyone's about. Oh, Sabre, thanks. Surprised there aren't more um, like actual vehicles to shoot. At. off it. Not sure where the fuck that thought it was going, because that's not at all where I fired it, but okay, maybe I can gun them. No. Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. Back to Gilly. Alright, we're on final pretty much. I've idled the engine, so we want to be like uh, 150 knots ish. Alright, flaps are going to landing, gear is coming down. Got two wrecks on the runway for some fucking reason. How do I have people manage that? Altitude, altitude. Uh, Lotus 1 1, you got a 6. This thing just doesn't slow down. I'm not even using any throttle at all right now. I'm trying to keep it at like 120 ish. Although we're actually clean, so I bet I can even go slower than that.
just some dude in the middle of the runway with a gun. That's a bit random. It's definitely not a pilot. Hey, yeah, you're right in the middle of the road. Yeah. All right. Would you like to move out of the way, Mr. Skyhawk? Or are you just gonna sit there? There we go. Oops, wrong button. All right, I'm gonna call that a fairly successful sortie. Uh, Thanks sure a lot for watching, folks. And I'll see you in the next one. one. Cheers. Nine.